Welcome back. It was a hot one today in Colorado. Here in Denver, 93 degrees, officially our hottest day of the year so far in Denver. We have hit 92 before, but we got above that today. Not quite to the record of 96, though, so still uh, fairly cool in terms of that. We got to 92 degrees here downtown. 77 is our average, so obviously we're running well above that. And right now, statewide, it is still pretty hot in some areas. 96 out in Burlington, 92 in Akron. We have 93 right now in Fort Collins. 96 in La Junta, 83 in Avon, 90 over in Grand Junction, and 83 from our weather watcher Hope in uh, the Castle Rock area for us this evening. And our current temperature downtown, both DIA and downtown, we have 89 degrees. And it is June officially. Our average high temperature is 82 degrees. The average low is 52. It's typically our third warmest month of the year. We usually get about two inches of rain, which makes it our third wettest month of the year. And we usually average about zero inches of snow. The last time we had snow in Denver in June was back in 1974. So it happens. It has just been a very, very long time. Wind speed still pretty gusty in some areas of the northwestern corner of the state through parts of the high country down into the southeastern corner of the state. We do still have a red flag warning in place for Moffitt and Rio Blanco counties through 8 o'clock tonight as we have gusty winds along with that very low humidity. And our satellite and radar is a little active. We do have some rain uh, mainly in the southern part of the state right now, but you can see all the way down into New Mexico and parts of eastern uh, Arizona. And that's all thanks to a part of this area of high pressure. It is keeping a moisture flow heading our way, but it's also keeping us on the hot side. It was toasty today, and we're going to stay warm throughout most of this week, but we will still have a few chances for thunderstorms to tap into coming in down from the southwest. So future cast for tonight, we will continue to see a little bit of rain out there. By tomorrow morning, we wake up to sunshine and clear skies, and there will be a chance of a few more afternoon isolated uh, thunderstorms coming our way. You'll notice it wasn't very widespread. Up into the northeastern corner of the state, there will be a chance for some severe storms tomorrow. Again, very isolated. If we do get one, there's a chance it could pop and bring us some hail and gusty winds. Tonight, you're looking at 60 in Denver, 62 in Boulder and Fort Collins, 59 out in Burlington, 40s, 50s in the high country. Tomorrow, 89 in Denver, 92 in Greeley, so a little cooler than today. Still hot, though, in the eastern plains, lots of 90s. 77 in Frisco, 78 in Aspen, 93 in Grand Junction for your five-day forecast. In the upper 80s again on Wednesday, and then we're back to the 90s on Thursday and then heading into the weekend, and there will be a chance, Karen, of a few isolated thunderstorms every day. All right, Laura.